in this video, I'll be talking about one of my businesses that reached a high and came crashing down. What I learned from this experience and what you can do to make sure that this doesn't happen to you. Let's begin. First, I'll take you to the beginning. Sometime in 2020, I stumbled on affiliate marketing with Medium. I had discovered this on the Daniel's Hustle YouTube channel. I even bought a course from him and I was stoked. I tried affiliate marketing with Medium but got my account banned. I did create a video on this and post it on the channel. I'll be linking that video in the description below so I don't have to go over the details. Anyway, fast forward to 2023 and I had just finished my master's from the University of British Columbia, Canada had a good job and now I felt I had the bandwidth to try affiliate marketing with Medium again. With some disposable income, I hired some writers and they began writing. In total, we wrote about 105 articles in a space of 9 months. The Medium account grew exponentially. We started out in August of 2023 and we had just 45 views and 20 reads. In September, 61 views and 23 reads. In October, 78 views and 158 reads. By January of 2024, we had 1.2k views and 700 35 reads. Our growth was steady. By April, we had 8,000 views and 4.8k reads. At this point, it was safe to say that by May, we're going to exceed 10,000 views. At this point, it was safe to say that this account was only going to keep growing. With 4.8k reads in April, I felt it was now time to start promoting affiliate products and at least make some money. If 4,000 people read your article and you have only a 0.1% conversion, that means 4 people would buy. And if what you're selling has an affiliate commission of $50, then you make $200. It's not a ton of money, but it's a good start. With all that in mind, we created an article that was specifically designed for affiliate marketing. We posted on the Medium account and the account got banned. Again, because my first account in 2020 got banned. Now I have reached out to Medium countless times to see if the account can be reinstated to no avail. Send them emails, talk to their support, no way. The account is gone. And even though this is a heartbreaking experience, there are two lessons that can be picked from it. The first and the most important one, obviously, is that when you are using a platform, you can never trust what's going to happen tomorrow. There are many people who lost their YouTube channels in the blink of an eye. This is why it's important to either collect emails or funnel your viewers to either your website or some other place where you have more more control, which is why we have decided to take all the articles from the Medium account and put them on a blog called millionairebyt25.com. If you do want to check out some of the articles, you can head over to the website. The second lesson, which is also important, is that most of these platforms do not like direct linking. The problem Medium had with our articles was that we directly linked to the affiliate product in the article. So if you're going to do affiliate marketing with Medium or any other platform for that matter, be sure to create a landing page first, put the link to your affiliate product in the landing page and then you take the website URL of your landing page and then put it in your Medium article. Any other way could get your account banned. That said, I hope you guys liked this video. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.